Um, you know, I thought we played well, but you know, not not as well as we would have liked to have played. You know, um, you know, our standard is, you know, we want to be able to keep the quarterback clean as possible uh, all the time. Um, and then in the run game, you know, we just want to make sure we, we give the running back a chance, give whoever it is running back there a chance. So. Yeah, it felt pretty good. It was really exciting. You know, um, just being able to run out there again and and play in front of ninety thousand fans, uh, playing with my teammates, it was it was awesome. Dylan was a freshman at quarterback. Mm-hmm. But did it feel like a true freshman out there leading Nebraska? Uh, you know, he's a really smart kid. Um, you know, I know he's not a kid. He's like 18, 19 years old. But um, he's very mature for his age. Um, you know, he, he reads the defense really well. He's able to get us in and out of plays, um, what he thinks is best fit for either run or pass game. And, and mm-hmm. I think he's got a really bright future here. So. He can make some of the throws he does. How, how much – Easier, does that make your job? Uh, yeah, I mean, it's it's pretty fun to watch him throw the ball. I mean, you know, there's a bunch of people comparing him to that guy up in Kansas City. Um, you know, I like to agree with them just because, um, you know, he plays really well. Uh, he throws the ball really well. He's very smart. Um, he helps us out a lot by getting the ball out pretty quick. So, yeah, he's a talented player. How did you kind of grade your performance going against that defensive line, specifically Westmoreland, and just kind of what they were able to do? Yeah, you know, Westmoreland, he was a very, very physical pass rusher. Um, he got me with an inside swim move and a, a bull pull one time. Um, you know, he's definitely going to be able to play on Sundays. Um, you know, that defensive line, you know, they were moving a lot up front. Uh, they got us a couple times, uh, put us in some pretty frustrating spots. But, you know, I thought we did all right for the, for the most part. Is that a nice challenge going forward to be able to go against a line like that? Mm. You know, what the defensive lines are going to face in the Big Ten coming, coming up here? Yeah, yeah. What about Colorado? Just the, when you look at their defense, what jumps out about what they showed against North Dakota State? Uh, yeah, you know, I thought they were really physical. Um, you know, they, they loaded the box up really well. Um, you know, they had a lot of good run fits. Um, you know, they're very physical in the pass game, too, um, getting after the quarterback, getting after that North Dakota State offensive line. Um, you know, but I'm just always looking, looking forward to the challenge. You know, we got a great team ahead of us this week, uh, looking at Colorado and just, you know, studying our butts off. So. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, every single week's a big week for us. Um, obviously, when we're playing at home, you know, it's a great advantage, but it doesn't matter who our opponent is. We're always um, looking forward to getting the best out of them and getting the best out of ourselves.